so let's solve these questions the question is the number of integral solution the number of integral solution of this inequality so there is inequality given we need to find the integral solution of this inequality okay so the question is x square plus 9 less than equal to x plus 3 whole square less than 8x plus 25 okay so this type of inequality is called simultaneous inequality okay so this is called simultaneous inequality basically you need to solve two inequality here first solve this part and again solve this part let's say this is one this is two and then after solving does these two inequality separately we need to take the intersection of both of them okay that will be your final answer so simply first solve this first in, in inequality solve this in, this inequality and then this inequality and then take intersection of both this answer so that will be your final answer okay so let's solve the first part first let's solve the first part first okay so x square plus 9 less than equal to let's open this so uh, let's first the first part first so the first part is x square plus 9 less than equal to x plus 3 whole square okay so let's open this bracket that is x square plus 9 plus 6x so can you see that that x square and 9 is getting cancelled so the remaining is 6x greater than 0 that means we can say that x is greater than 0 okay because 6 is positive so we can oh we can send it to the right side and 0 by 6 is 0 okay so the x is positive x is greater than 0 so the solution of this part is x belongs to 0 to infinity solution of the first part is x belongs to 0 to infinity let's solve the second part let's solve the second part the second part is uh, x plus 3 whole square minus sorry less than 8x plus 25 so x square plus 9 plus 6x less than 8x plus 25. So let's take all the terms in the left side to the left side. So x square it will be minus 2x plus it will be um it will be 16. There's 9 minus 25, so it's minus 16, it will be minus 16. Okay. Yes, x square minus 2x minus 16. So um, this cannot be factorized, right? This cannot be factorized. So let's find the value of x. Let's find the value of x. 2 plus minus uh, b square, that means 4 minus 4ac, that means 64 plus 64 because c is minus 16 by 2 into 1. So it will become 2 plus minus root 68 that means let's first let's write 60, 68 only so it is going to become because 68 can be written as 17 into 4 so 4 will get, come out as a 2 so it will be 1 plus minus root 17 1 plus minus root 17 so this quadratic equation can be written like this so this quadratic equation this quadratic equation can be written like this x minus 1 minus root 17 x minus 1 plus root 17 less than is equal to 0 so the solution of this inequality will be plot the number line and sorry draw a number line and plot the point i mean the critical point that is 1 minus root 17 and 1 plus root 17 so here it will be positive negative and positive so the answer is required is less than 0 that means negative part so the solution of this part is x belongs to x belongs to x belongs to 1 minus root 17 to 1 plus root 17 but we need to take the we need to take we need to take the intersection of these two solutions that is part one and part two so let's take the intersection one is one minus root 17 
to 1 plus root 17 that means this is the answer this is the solution for part 2 and the part 1 solution is x is greater than 0 x is greater than 0 that means 0 to 0 to infinity so the common part here is that you can see clearly the common part here is this part this portion 0 to 1 plus root 17 so the answer is final answer is x belongs to 0 to 1 plus root 17 and what is the value of root 17 it will be x belongs to 0 to 4 point something so it will be 5.1 let's say 5.1 so we need the integral solution we need the integral solution what we need is integral solution that is number of integral solution so if this is the case okay what is the question that is asking number of integral solution so how many integral solution are there in 0 to 5.4 uh, in 0 to 5.1 see 0 will not come because 0 is excluded here the first will be 1 2 3 4 and 5 so integral solution will be 1 2 3 4 and 5 so there are five integral solution you will get for this question so there are five integral solution the answer is d that is 5 so the answer is d because you will get the five integral solution that is 1 2 3 4 and 5 